name is Hannah, AKA Honey. I have my sister with me here today. Hello. <laughs> Katie. <laughs> Um, today we have what we got our kids for their stockings. So if you are familiar with us, uh, this year will be is our fourth year of doing what we got our kids for Christmas. This is our first year of what we got our kids for their stockings. And frankly, I am pretty excited to show you guys all the cool stuff that we got. Yeah. So I have two kids. I have a four and a four and a half year old named Mac, AKA B. And then I have an almost two-year-old, so close to two-year-old daughter named Sunny. And I have five girls. They are 11, 9, 5, 4, and almost three. <laughs> She's just laying out the ages. It just started to sound like you were counting. <laughs> so I know. You know, <laughs> yeah, my youngest three are around a year apart, so um, each of them. So it's, it's a little bit hard sometimes to decide which things I'm going to get which kid because they have a lot of similarities because they're pretty close in age, so. All right, well, thank you guys for being here today. I, we have a lot of fun stuff to show you, so stick around and we'll be right back. All right, so we are gonna get started today. We're actually gonna do the littlest kids first. So I have everything here for my almost two-year-old daughter, and she has everything laid out for her almost three, four, and five-year-old daughter. Um, because right. then you'll switch to kind of a boy, the boy stuff, and then I'll do my older girl thing, things after that, so. All right, so let's get started. Also, uh, again, if you haven't checked it out already, we have a big seven kid, what we got our kids for Christmas video. I'm gonna link it at the end of this video. Make sure you watch it. It has so many cool, unique ideas in it. Some good uh, ideas for stores, sales, uh, we are definitely bargain sale shoppers. Uh, so if you're like us, you can get so many good ideas from it. So make sure you check it out. Yeah. All right, so let's get started. All right, so the first thing I have here, get this. So this is something that I think my sister got last year yeah. for her daughter. Uh huh. Um, and I saw them play with it a lot throughout the year. I had, it's very like open-ended. It can do a lot of different things. This is a silicone rainbow stacking toy. I got it's this so from cute. Amazon. Um, a lot of them are wooden and I really like that this one was silicone because it just would have a fun, more fun, like kind of texture feel. Um, and also you could kind of bend them and do different kind of building projects with them. This came in a, a bright, shade which is this one and then they also had one that was a little more uh, muted neutral shades for the I rainbow. Think I, mine was like um I think our dog got a hold of our Oh no! Because the silicone is kind of a fun dog. Yeah thing. it's it's really just kind of a fun feeling it's kind of you could do a lot of different building things with them mm -hmm. stack them upside down um, whatever, I whatever have, like different be. earth tones. So there's lots of different tones and they're nice and small. They're a perfect yeah. stocking stuffer. So it was a really good stocking stuffer. I think it was uh, maybe around $10. Mm -hmm. um, but I just thought it was really cute. I love the colors and I know my daughter will Those really love it. Those are fun colors. Yeah. So um, just a really good little option that she can be super creative with and play with. All right. So, oh goodness, I just have such a variety here. All right, the first thing, I actually got this at Kroger. I went I love saw this it. toy. It lights up. Um, and it's like a pop, pop it. Is that what you call those? Pop it? Yeah. So you can pop them, um, and then you can push it together, and it all unpops, which is kind of fun. And then it also has suction cups, so you can, like, suction it on a window. or So it's just a it's a fidget toy. Pull That's my and favorite pop, part. Light up cat caterpillar so maybe you're supposed to pull it instead of pushing it together to Is that make... oh, oh that yeah. pops them out too that's just kind of a fun noise are like the most fun because you just mm -hmm. i love that sound i've been over here doing this between takes <laughs> he's like okay stop <laughs> oh it's really so fun i'm gonna give that to my youngest because my four-year-old hates bugs and you she... might not even know it's a bug though She'll like i don't know bug. she she will not have any interest <laughs> in this but i think my um three-year-old will be all about it it's so. really cute all right the next thing i got for sunny so these were on um a special deal at uh amazon hmm. and they're little like blind bags but they're disney characters 
and they're just kind of little like handheld bean bags. Oh, and that's she fun. really loves um, everything Disney right now. They're all going to be kind of surprise characters, and then they all have the little keychain holder to carry them around in. So they were really inexpensive. I think did I get one, two, three, four? I think I got five of them. There's oh, five yeah. or six of them. Okay, okay. yeah. Um, and they'll all be a surprise character. I don't even know what all they can be, but they were less than a dollar each, and I think she'll just have a lot of fun, you know, carrying them around and looking at them and things like that. So it's fun that they're being really bags. cute little, yeah, little inexpensive um, stocking stuffer that I think she'll really enjoy. All right, this is one that I'm probably gonna open in. There's four vehicles, so I'll probably do give two to my um, two-year-old two almost three-year-old um and then two to my four-year-old um they just really like trucks and tractors oh no wait there's five so i don't know we'll split them up though those are fun i feel like my kids are gonna want to steal those they actually these were really inexpensive and they like recommended them for like cake toppers if you're having a construction oh, but i just thought they were nice idea too, though. little toys and it has two different um excavator type things diggers which is what my kids are all about um, so just kind of a fun little Where did set. you find them? Uh, Amazon. Okay. And they're cat brand, C-A-T. Those so. are really cute. All right, next I have, let's do these. So these are little water babies that I found at Five Below. And so I don't know if you remember, like when we were kids, we loved our water babies. Yeah, they were big, but. Yeah, they were bigger than this, but. Um, Sunny, I think these will be a really good size for her to carry around, but they'll also be really good bath toys. Mm -hmm. Both of my kids are little fish when it comes to bath time. Um, so this one is a mermaid. This one is, I don't know, a not a mermaid. <laughs> they were $5 each and I think they'll be excellent bath toys and she'll really love them. Um, yeah, we have those. My yeah. kids really enjoy them. I, so. That's what I was going to say. When her kids were little, they had these and they, they still have them. played we them still with have them, them constantly. So I felt like I needed you just have to replace them. Needed her own set. Um, so day. they're super cute and she'll love them. And the duck on her head is so yeah, cute. Yeah, it's adorable. <laughs> All right, this I got for my five year old. It's Canoodle Junior. Um, and it's like a game that they have to play, kind of a puzzle game. It's for ages four to seven. My oldest daughter, we got her like the regular canoodle and she has really enjoyed it. So I thought because they kind of have similar, like they both enjoy those types of things. Um, I thought we would try to get the younger version as well. And there's also like canoodle extreme, like there's all different versions now, but it's a great little game and a great stocking stuffer. If you have bigger kids, you can get the bigger one, but um, where'd you find it? Either Amazon or Target. You can find them anywhere. Okay. So, yeah. All right. Sorry, I'm... that sun is coming down. <laughs> so next I'm going to do um, the little people that I have for Sunny. We've, she's so, if you check it out again, our Christmas video, she's getting basically the entire Barbie little people collaboration set. Um, these are all the little smaller characters. She's getting the car and the house. Um, but these are each little like smaller sets that are two packs of characters. Um, they're all so cute and like detailed and like, I love them. their hair. This one has braided hair. This one is differently these abled in a wheelchair. Cute little dresses. I know this one is like, has a little present in her hand. These ones are swimming. They're just the cutest little sets. Like I am obsessed with the Barbie little people collaboration. Um, I just love it. So I, I, these are all that set. This one is not part of that set, but I just thought she was the cutest little girl and she, she looks cute. a lot like my daughter. <laughs> and um, when I saw it, I was just like, oh, stocking stuffer, <laughs> so cute. So I grabbed that. Usually you can find these. Um, I actually got this one at Target, but they sell little single packs of little people um, at Target and they're really inexpensive and just a great stocking stuffer for little kids. All right, so. That sun just keeps going in. I'm just keep like leaning towards you. <laughs> All right, so these are just random. Um, this I think I got at the dollar spot. They're rainbow magic. The Target dollar spot? Yeah. Okay. Um, and I also have Coco Melon band aids coming too. These ones are cool though because they like actually are like shaped like they're not the traditional. Oh. Yeah. Well, 
I guess some of them are traditional, but it looks, at least it looked like I thought that they have, I don't know. Anyway, my kids love band-aids. Like anytime they, they like- use them on their skin or just like yeah. anywhere? No, but like not when they actually need them. Like anytime they bump their knee, they want a band-aid. Like it doesn't matter if it's bleeding or cut. Like it doesn't, it just, they love to have a band-aid. <laughs> it makes so, them feel better. It's fantastic. Yes. So I got, <laughs> my five-year-old and my two, almost three-year-old, um, each a pack of band-aids because we go through them quite quickly <laughs> at my house. I love that. Um, okay, so next I have a few things of candy that I got at Five Below. Both of my kids uh, absolutely love anything that's gummy. And if you check out your local Five Below, they have some really Best. fun, unique things. Yes. So for Sunny, I got this big gummy donut. Um, and you'll see my son's equivalent item in a minute. It's really cute too. Mm -hmm. um, and then I also got her these Haribo mini rainbow frogs and the Haribo rainbow worms. I Below is a great place to get yeah, candy. Yeah, they have so much fun you need candy. So if you're looking for some special items for stocking stuffers, like it's, it's incredible for They that. have like a big pizza. Um, yeah uh, our like elf comes and i often will get like fun candy for the elf to bring like one random day and one yeah. day they've got like they brought a pizza and there's like a lunchable that's all gummy there's like a pack of hot dogs yeah a pack like bacon like all kinds of fun and also like food you could kind of trick your kids with if you were mm -hmm. trying to do like a dessert breakfast i think there's a lunchable now a lunchable. there is a lunchable it's really cute yeah, also good for April Fool's Day. <laughs> All yes, right. Yes, April Fool's Day. <laughs> um, I don't know how you say this. We love schlike, schlike <laughs> animals. Um, we've been working on, like, we just kind of add to our collection every holiday. And we've been, we pretty much have all, like, the farmer farmer ones now. And now we're working on, like, African animals. So this set came up for a really good price. It has a chimpanzee, a zebra, although a chimpanzee isn't an African animal. That's interesting. Is it not? No, it would be more of like a, right? You can, right. There's not chimps running around. I mean, there's certain monkeys, but I'm pretty positive. There's not, like when you're on Disney's Animal Kingdom Safari, you don't see a chimpanzee. Maybe they don't have them there. I don't know. Anyway, it's in the box. It just seems like a random animal with a lion, a zebra, and an elephant, but whatever. We love these animals. Please My don't kids. educate us below. Cause no, they're, a chimpanzee is a jungle animal. Oh, and these are like Sahara animals, like uh, desert? Well, like the other three are Savannah? African. Savannah yeah. animals? Yeah. I, whatever. Anyway, it doesn't matter. My, we're trying to add to our collection. Um, we have a mom and a dad elephant. We didn't have a baby elephant, and now and we don't have any of the other animals. So now you do. Have we're, a baby. we're just going with it, and I liked the size of them. So this is cute. Okay, next. So I have several little bluey sets. Um, she's getting a lot of other bluey stuff, but these are kind of the smallest sets. This is the part of the school friends. Uh, package. It is the ter terrier, Terriers family. So there's three of those little guys in there. And then um, cute. this is, this is my favorite set. Like I can, I can't get over this set. So this is from like the Christmas episode where they do the Christmas swimming <laughs> and Nana is here, which I really love because my kids call their grandma Nana. Um, and it oh, comes, she has, cute I know, she has the cutest little glasses and it comes with the little doll in a doll box that Bluey gets for Christmas that year. And it's, it's this, it's just the cutest thing. So this set comes with Nana, Bluey, and the little doll is called Bartleby. Um, so I think Sunny will love this set. And then she's also getting this set, which is kind of like a little tea party set. And that comes with Bingo and Lila. And these were all really good deals. Um, if you check Amazon, a lot of these uh, Bluey sets have been coming up with added on coupons and you get them for 50% off or more. So they've been fantastic deals this year. All right, so I, for whatever reason, really like when I can put a stuffed animal like sticking out the top or like a doll. So I got my youngest uh, JJ from Coco Melon Little Plush and it hasn't come yet, but it is coming. It's just like a basic. 
Does it chew and dull? Okay. No, just like a soft bodied. Um, I love and then her. I know, and you'll see I have another one um, for my nine year old. So this one looks more like um, my five year old, and I just think she's so cute. This is from Target, and they're, it was only $15, which to me, they have like cute boy ones, they have like all different ones. Her body looks like it's linen almost in the clothes. It's, it looks she like you seems can swap them out. Nice quality. She's really cute. And for 15 bucks, it seems like a really good deal. So yeah, I like her. Anyway, I got her that one. Um, and then I got my um, four-year-old this little cabbage patch that looks like a flamingo because she likes Why they put animal. plastic on its hands like that? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I'll probably take that off. But where is that one from? I got this as Costco as part of a three set, but we've already oh, like oh yeah um pulled out the other two yeah for different <laughs> things. So anyway. Um, those are the stuffed animal friends that they are getting to stick out of theirs. Okay, so my last item that I have for Sunny, it's clearly not stocking size, but I thought it would be really cute instead of wrapping these up or covering them for Christmas day, that I could just use these kind of as their stockings and put everything inside mm -hmm. of their chairs. I got these chairs for both of my kids and I was trying to get kind of that pottery barn aesthetic um, and I was looking at those chairs where you get the monogrammed or get your child's name on it. And it was uh, going to be over $150 to do that. And that just seemed like a lot. So I found these on Amazon. It's really the same exact shape. Um, they had them with the, kind of this plush fabric. And, and then they had them with kind of just, you know, regular cotton fabric. These ones were a little bit cheaper, which is why I went with them. <laughs> My kids don't care, honestly. Like, they're going to love having their own little chair to sit in in our family room um if they don't have their name on them unfortunately but I mean like I said it was a way better deal and I felt way better about it these came from Amazon like completely com compressed in a box like vacuum sealed oh. so and this has been open less than 24 hours and it already looks this good like it's real firm yeah a nice, nice hard like not hard cushion but like it's not gonna cave in as soon as they sit in it it has a little handle on the back. Um, so this is the one that I picked for my daughter and then I'll, I'm gonna swap everything in out and I'll show you the one I got for my son too. All right. So one thing I got for all five of my kids are just these basic ribbon dancing, ribbon twirl things. They're super cheap. I think I got like a pack of like 20 of them from Amazon. Um, yeah, or maybe, maybe 25, yes, from Amazon. And I just, like, they have enjoyed these so much. So I figure, like, they I'll put one in their Easter baskets. Like, because they don't last forever. They're not, like, stellar quality. They get tangled or, um, you know, like, knotted or whatever. But they love to, like, put on music and do dances and stuff with these. And so, do performances or shows for the family. Yeah, so I got them it's each awesome. one of those for their stockings. They're great value. They really, for their price, they get a ton of play value, at least they have in my house. So, All right, I'm going to do a quick swap and grab my son's stuff. All right, some other things I've gotten. This pocket purse. The handle must be inside the thing, but I just thought my five-year-old would like it. She's real girly girl, and these are really big to things. Yeah, they're not usually that. And big. this was like two dollars or something on Amazon. Big poppet purse. That's nice. I love that. Yeah. And then I got this fun little thing. It's called a sky tail, and it's from Sarah Silks. Um, which we have gotten their play silks a few different times. I think last, enjoy. last year in our Christmas video, you had play silks. Yeah. Yeah. They really enjoy playing with them. Um, mostly for dress up. Like they'll, we'll wrap them around as like a dress or whatever, but I'll show you what this looks like. Goodness gracious. It is packaged cute. It's called a sky tail and it's just like essentially a oh, ball cute. with, but it's really nice and soft. So like if they throw it inside, it's not like yeah. it's not something I have to worry about being damaged. Or if it clunks somebody. Yeah. So I just thought it, it was looks pretty. like actually like air can move through this and fill up this because this is like a tail that's um like I don't know how to say, like 
like two layers yeah it's multiple layers so mm -hmm. that it could fill up with yeah you're probably and make a right. nice tail yeah that's cute so anyway i just thought that looked fun and i thought it would be a fun stocking stuffer and that's from nice sarah quality. silks sarah silks but i bought it on amazon so we were we have gotten several things from that company and really like it yeah you have worked from them several times they have now. cute like fairy wands we've gotten one of those um like uh veils and wings and all kinds of fun stuff oh cool so, yeah all right so um again i just showed you my daughter's little chair this is the one i got for my son um i was debating they had this gray color and they also had a navy blue and i couldn't really decide um which one to get him but i i really do like the color of this one like you can see like it's puffed up so well um, it seems like the construction is really good. It has the little handle on the back to move it easily. Um, and I think, you know, he'll really like it. I'll show you a first item from here as well. <laughs> so this is, this is kind of almost like Hot Wheels answer to the color change Barbie or like the reveal, reveal Barbie. Yeah. Um, well, they're both by Mattel. So that makes sense. Okay. So this is a color reveal Hot Wheels car. It comes with two cars and um oh, i think you put it you clean it and then you have to try it in hot water and cold water to see if it has like hidden color changes with it um so it was just a nice little inexpensive set it comes with two cars and if you watch our uh what we got our kids for christmas video we have we both got really big track sets hot wheels track sets for our kids this year for great deals and i think these will, these will work on those as well so that'll yeah. be really fun all right so this is another thing i got this at kohl's and i'm sure you can get it anywhere um i so honestly cute. was looking for something that like because i needed just like a few more dollars to get free shipping and i saw this and it's kind of like those round you know like yeah, we, had we have those and we play with them all the time but i thought that this was like better for smaller kids because it's like more cushiony um and so it comes with two balls and I just thought it's something the balls are super soft so we can they can play it inside if they want um and so I think I'm gonna put one in one kid stocking with a ball like probably my four-year-old and then my five-year-old oh, in the idea. other one so that they each have one and then it's a game they can play together um but that's by Melissa and Doug and there was another animal too like maybe a dolphin or um so they have a couple different versions of this exact same thing but we got the crabs. It's really cute. <laughs> um, let me turn this guy around. Okay, so these are the five below candies that I got for my son. Um, so this is a box of gummies and it's, it says Kraft macaroni and cheese on it. It looks like a box of macaroni and cheese. I just thought it was so cute and kind of cheeky when I saw it. <laughs> Um, all the gummies are like big macaroni noodles. Uh, I just thought it was really so cute and cute. unique. And then I also got him these two uh, Mario candies. And I, what is it in here? This says it has sour, mushroom sours in it. I'm not really sure what exactly is in there. Um, and this has coins, coin candy in it. Huh. Um, I like these a lot because they're tin oh, and they're actually fun. can be toys after, you know, he eats the candy and everything because he's so into Mario. Um, he can use these with his figures and his play sets. And, um, I thought they were really good kind of double duty yeah, toy those are really candy cute. item. So, and really, I don't think you can find any like accessories like this size, um, like a, a, a block or a mushroom that are this big. Um, a lot of them are kind of smaller and choking size, which I worry about with my daughter. So I was really excited when I saw these and I think I'll really like them. Yeah, those are cool. Um, speaking of five below, is that where these are from? That's where these I are from. These. They, I thought this was, I mean, I think it was $5, but how many? One, two, three, four, five, six mm -hmm. different balls. It says it right there. <laughs> They're all different, but my kids love playing with balls and throwing things and I liked that they had different they're all different like squeezy um, sensory type balls yeah so sensory squeezy they're really cool so I don't know if I'm just gonna wrap it as one and put it in one kid stockings or if I'll open it up and give like each kid two balls or something but 
Um, They'll all share it around either way. It's interesting though. It, it says, says it has two stretchy balls, two crunchy and two squishy. Yeah. That's really fun. It says age is six plus though, which is kind of funny because, well, I probably just don't want anyone like biting them open. Maybe. <laughs> That's <laughs> what Amy would do immediately. <laughs> okay, next. Um, I got, so this is a Sonic figure that he's going to be getting. Um, this was uh, one that I found at uh, GameStop. It was on clearance for $9.97 and I got half off of that. Um, right now they're having just an additional 50% off of all their clearance items. So it's a really good time to go if your kids are into any of this kind mm. of stuff. Um, this was a really unique figure. Did you just get that recently then? I just got it like a few days ago. Mm. Um, he loves the Sonic figures that come with the gems, which this one does. And also the coloring on it, if you can see, is really unique. This is some kind of 30th anniversary edition Sonic. I don't know. I don't care. But it was very inexpensive. It's a new figure. These figures go through a lot of wear and tear in our house, especially Sonic, because he has such thin kind of legs. They come off, break off so easily. I feel like I'm constantly replacing these kind of things. So anytime I find one on sale, it is in my car and you know, I you know, I just gotta have it. So uh, he'll be really excited to get this one. All right. So this is another thing I got. It comes with six, so I'll probably give each kid two, each of my little kids two. Is it ice cream cones? Yes, they're ice cream oh. cones, which actually is like their favorite thing to play with, with Kinetic Sand, like pretending they're ice cream. We have an ice cream like sensory play set. We love Kinetic Sand, but you just kind of have to replace the sand with all the yeah. toys once every once in a while. And and yeah, and they get you know, like there's always some that spills over from the countertop when we're playing, but um, these are all different scents also. I'm a, my favorite kinetic sand is actually the natural color one because it has the best texture. The colored ones are like not as textured, which is interesting, but I just thought since this is kind of fun that they have ice cream cones and they're a nice size for stockings, so they'll each get two. I feel like you can always count on Kinetic Sand products to be really good deals around the yes. holidays. Yeah. And there's like so many options. So like if you're looking for something similar um, or even the exact same thing, it's an easy thing to find. Like Target, Walmart. Yeah, because last year we bought sets on sale. You bought like whole um, like play sets. Yeah, yeah, like a construction one and a candy lane. And we have played with them. We keep them up in our cupboard and they, I mean, they have played with them constantly, especially in the winter time when you're inside a lot more. They're such a great toy. Yeah. So. Okay, next. So my son is really into Minecraft right now. These are again, um, sets that I got at uh, GameStop. Some of them uh, were on sale. Like this one was clearance for $8.97. So I got it for what, $4.50. Um, some of them I got on Amazon. They were on sale, but not as much. Um, but I, he got, the, he's gonna get the little piggy set here, this dolphin, Enderman, and then he's also getting this, whoops, a Steve. And I know its name is Steve. And I don't know anything about Minecraft. So the only thing, all I can think about is like, this stresses me out. I'm like, these are so many pieces to have all over my house. He's just so <laughs> into like action figures yeah. and imaginative play and In stuff fact, like that. In fact, the soccer season, he and yeah. my two girls were on the same team and he always like had a like, figure yeah. in his hand to play. Like he didn't yeah. feel comfortable Really unless he had an action figure. Unless he had an action figure in his hand. <laughs> That's like so classic Mac. Um, so he's getting all of that set. And then he's also getting this like a little bit bigger set. It's called the Otherworld Survivor Pack. I found this on Amazon. It comes with a Steve and a couple, oh, that one kind of fell, a pickaxe, a sword, a couple blocks and a bed. Um, hmm. So he's been playing Minecraft a lot recently with his dad and I. We all play together at night. He, it's like his you guys are all thing he looks forward that. to. Yeah, we're a, quite a, very much like a video game family. We love that kind of stuff. <laughs> so as soon as he was like old enough to actually um, enjoy, it. enjoy it and do it, like we started doing it. It's kind of a special activity for the three of us after little sissy goes to bed. Um, and it's definitely been like something he's so interested in right now. 
and is super excited about. So we're just kind of riding that, riding the tails of his excitement and have found these kind of cool things. Well, to it's just something up. that you all enjoy too. Like it's not yeah. something we do very often, although we love, you play like we Switch do play games, the Switch, and we, we love too, Boomerang Foo. It's such a fun, it's family such a good game. family game. If yeah. you're not really like a gamer, like I'm not. Yeah, my husband enjoys games, but like, but I love Boomerang Foo and so playing fun. those with my kids is yeah. really fun. So, all right, I got a classic Slinky. <laughs> Actually, I think. Um, I just needed is to it get, metal? like the free shipping. I want it. I was gonna open it, but it's it actually is like one of those that's like almost glued, you know. So it would, but yes, it is metal and it's the original Slinky. And I just thought that it would be fun. So I also got bubbles. Um, oh, they're little cocoa melon bubbles. Yes, yeah, so they're cocoa melon and they're uh, berry scented. Are they bath so, bubbles or are they to blow? It says bubble bath. Bath time, berry scented, scented bubble bath and wand. So I don't know. Oh, maybe so for actually, a, I don't know. Where did you find them? This was at the dollar spot, okay. and I just thought that my um, youngest would like like that JJ was on it because that is a character that she really yeah. enjoys. So okay, the next thing Mac is getting. So he's getting um, for Christmas like three or four different big uh, Mario play sets. And these are all the like single packs of the two inch figures that are made to go with those play sets. Um, and these are, again, these were from GameStop. Like this one was $3.97 and half off of that. Hmm. So super cheap for these little guys. And I literally just got him every one that was there and available, so, or like not every one, but one of each. Um, so he got, he's getting these four and then, you know, he already has a bunch of different ones, but in the play sets come with more, but all the ones they had there, again, it was like a dollar fifty each. So I grabbed him one of each um, and I'll have a lot of fun with these. Love it. All right, and so the last thing for my little kids is, and I'm, I'm still debating if I'm gonna like wrap these individually or just give this to one of my kids as one of their main Christmas presents. Well, they're so um, cute. It'll probably depend on what I like find at Black Friday and as more deals mm -hmm. come, like I'm sure I'll buy a few more things. But So it has like three costumes in it. Yeah, so I thought I could like, you know, roll up one costume per kid to put in their stockings. And it comes, it has sounds, which I don't really fully understand. 11 pieces included. So it has like a hand thing, a thing for their body, but like a, a hand puppet. For, yeah, and a thing for their head. Oh, that's cute. I think this was like $8 on Amazon. Like it was a deal. And I just thought like they really like Baby Shark. I'm trying to think, hat and top two, four, six. Oh, it has a sound box. I don't know what that does, but that is that's what makes it have the okay the eleven pieces. <laughs> so anyway, it actually comes in a cute box too. It is so. a really cute box. I, know, I might save it for a gift, but I don't know. It's also something that's something like I like to do, especially because I have like multiple kids that are pretty close in age. Is like find things that I could divide. Um, mm -hmm. and that they could enjoy together, but like, you know, it fills each of their stockings in a different way. So, and this was a really good deal for that. So, all right. Uh, Max last gift that he is getting for his stocking. So we have a couple of Lego sets. Um, he's just on the age where he's going to be ready to play with Lego. Um, but he's very interested in building and doing this kind of play. So I feel like with help from me or his dad, he'll be able to follow the instruction books and complete these projects. Um, I got these all super on sale from Target. Um, they were part of a spend $50 on Legos and get a free $10 gift card. Oh, yeah. um, and, but they were also on sale on top of that. So he's getting this little Minecraft uh, Lego set and then this uh, Spider-Man Lego set. And then I also added in, they had all of these platforms and I feel like this is kind of something that you usually need, but you don't think of at the time. Um, they had them on sale. They were only $7. They had them in all different colors. So I got him just one gray platform as a base so that he can build the things on it and it can stay together. Um, 
and we'll help him kind of hopefully keep these these sets nice and put together but we'll see <laughs> <laughs> this is a really for his age because this says four plus i like yeah. the size of them like it will keep their attention you know it's not like something gigantic yeah, it's not they super can, complicated to make they can get it done and then enjoy it mm -hmm. um in a good time frame all right, I'm going to switch out to my older kids because I think that's all of our little kid stuff, right? Yeah, yeah. it is. All right, so we're going right, to switch out. out. <laughs> all right, so these are what I have for our stock, like my kids' stockings, um, the older girls. Yeah, and it's 9 and 11. I'm still, like, trying to brainstorm a little bit some ideas for my 11-year-old. Um, if you have any great ideas, <laughs> feel free to comment down below with them. Um because she's not like a super girly girl. Like, she, like she's not super into makeup yet or anything like that, but. Not like know, your like, five-year-old. She your doesn't five -year -old want loves like, makeup. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> my five-year-old <laughs> loves makeup. Um, and she's just not, I don't know, but she's not into like, like little toys either. So I don't know, but I did find some things. Yeah, I think, I think you've got some good. good ideas here. Um, all right, so the first thing I got for my nine-year-old is this doll, and it will go with um, my five-year-old's doll because they play. They're so they cute do play together. They're so cute, and this one looks like my nine-year-old, and this one looks like my five-year-old, and I just think they are so adorable. They are really cute. And I cute. like that they both had, like, purple shorts. Like, they like, like, I don't know. I just think they're so cute. These are from Target, <laughs> right? Yeah. Okay. They're Pillow Fort brand, and they will just kind of stick out of their stockings, so... Oh, I just really, really cute. Them. Um, dolls are like my weakness, so. <laughs> <laughs> um, all right. So my nine-year-old is obsessed with ducks. She has been since she was little. Yeah. Like, and she is. I think for Easter, we might get her act like a real duck. I really debated. She, now she can't watch this video. Oh, no. <laughs> Well, we might, but we're not day, sure. Probably yeah, not. Probably, probably not. not. One day, maybe we'll get a duck. Or I mean, actually, ducks are flocking birds. I have learned because we've been researching. So you're <laughs> not supposed to have only one. You should have at least two or three. <laughs> but just all the things are so expensive, and obviously, like winter time, we have winters where we live, like full fledged winters. So. Um, this isn't the best time to start, start a herd. <laughs> yes. So maybe in the spring, but I had to get her something duck related because she loves ducks. And I thought this was fun. My dad has done some like Disney versions of these 3D puzzles mm -hmm. and they like end up as like a solid plastic thing. Um, I'm a little like it says ages 12 plus. So I think it's a little complicated. So I think it's something that she might need some help with either from my older daughter or me or my husband. Um, but anyway, I just thought it's something she can do and then it would be cute like on her. Where did you find it? Amazon. Okay. And they have all kinds of different ones. There's different birds and cars and um, treasure chests and hearts and and all different Disney characters. So there's lots of different ones, but I got the duck. She, in general, loves birds. <laughs> For her birthday this year, I feel like that's so unique about her, though. I love yes, it. She Not just many loves kids birds. Are obsessed with birds. Um, and for her ninth birthday she requested that we go and hold parrots <laughs> and that's what we did so we Where went did you hold parrots um in tennessee what? Yeah. i have not heard this you haven't seen the pictures of her holding these giant parrots no in what anyway i will <laughs> well <laughs> it's <laughs> adorable so we did that and um she loves sh so any type of bird but she really loves penguins also, and I saw these at Five Below. They're penguin squishies, so similar to the balls that I got. Um, they're all different colors and it looks different. Looks like they have like Orbeez beads inside. Yeah. Things, one, two, three, there's four. Four of them? Yes. Yep. She told me she would like a pet penguin as well, and I had to, <laughs> I was like, um, we can't have a pet penguin where we live. So anyway. Those are cute. I just thought they were cute. And they're um, from Five Below? Yes, okay. Five Below. Um, other things I got her, these are for like Welly Wisher size dolls, which she um, has a couple of and really likes. Um, I saw them this year at Costco, like full Welly Wisher sets, which I've seen 
the babies before, like in gift sets at Costco, but never the Welly Wishers. So if you're looking for one, they're they're there. Yeah, so this, they're just cute little like size. This is actually a ribbon dancer, well, gymnastic set, I guess, but it has like a ribbon. Mm -hmm. um, and then, so this is the Glitter Girls brand, which is a nice like brand. It's not the American Girl brand, but they fit the same and they have dolls also that are the same size. And then this is actually an American Girl. Um, it's like a, like it has crutches. It's a hugs and healing set, x-rays and a cast and things like that. So I just thought those were a nice size. I feel like kids will love, like, was there nothing cooler in middle school than like having to be on crutches? <laughs> like, true. seriously, like, I remember one time I was on crutches and I was like, I have the coolest kid. <laughs> I never have gotten to <laughs> Or if you get crutches. a cast. Yeah, I've never had a cast either and everyone signs it. Yeah. It's pretty cool stuff. And she's actually our only, our only kid that has broken, broken an arm. Yeah. yeah. So. All right. So another thing we got her, this was actually my husband's idea. This has, um, there's a whole series. So we'll see if she likes it, but it's the rescue of the unicorn, but it's one of those choose your own ending books. Oh, so she can read so it cool. And there's 24 different endings. Wow. I don't even know how they do that. This is showing you like a tree on the back where like all the decisions change, like what the possible ending can be. Yeah. Which is really cool. So I thought she would just think that was Oh, it like, has pictures too. Yeah. Which is like, like really appropriate for her age. Good for her age. Yeah. So where is this from? Amazon also. Okay. They have a whole series. Um, I thought she would like the unicorn one, but if she likes more, we can get more. Lots of like re-readability too, to try to get different endings. Yeah. By making different choices. Very cool. Yeah. And it's a nice size for a stocking. Mm -hmm. So, all right. The ribbon <laughs> dancing as I got all my kids. Yep. And then this was a Polly Pocket. I don't even know where I got this. Polly Pocket Maze Mania. It's just different mazes and has like a fun little handheld maze. maze on the front. So that is what I got to my nine-year-old. Um, like I said, I probably need to get, well, we're doing pretty good. I One of my goals this year, which might sound silly, was to have everything fit in their stocking. <laughs> Cause usually I just have it like, like coming out, but we'll see. I don't know. This still seems like it probably won't fit. The stockings don't hold much. No, not really. <laughs> and I don't, I just can't buy like random crap. Like I just don't. Yeah. Like. Not the goal. Yeah. All right. So this is like filament. Is that how you say that word? Mm -hmm. Filament. Um, for her 3d like pen that she's getting for Christmas. So I got her extra filament <laughs> to put in her stocking. Although this is pretty airtight. I'm not sure if it will fit in, but we'll see. Um, she really likes peppermint. So I got a few things of peppermint, um, of different chapsticks of candy cane and then mint tea. tea. She loves peppermint tea. And then I also got her Altoids. I don't think she's ever had an Altoid, oh, but really? they were like really cool when we were kids Yeah, and she loves mints. So I thought she would, um, think these were fun. You can keep them in her backpack. Or yeah. Whatever. Yeah. And then let's see, I got her this random journal from, this was from um, Amazon. You can get them in all different names and different things, but it's oh. Hattie's books of awesome ideas and epic thoughts. Um, is it all just lined pages? Yeah, it's just lined pages. Okay. And actually that reminds me, I don't know where it went, but I also got her a book that is like for writers. Maybe it hasn't come yet. I bet it hasn't come yet. Um, I got her a book that's for um, kids that want to be writers one day, which is what she wants to be. And it's like a book you read through, like it gives you some good information. So she'll be getting that also, but it hasn't come yet. Um, so anyway, she loves to write. So I just liked that it had her name. I also got her, she loves avocados, which this obviously you're not eating. It's a face mask, but I thought she might think it's fun since it's an avocado kind. Is it printed like an avocado? Oh, it's a clay mask. Yeah, so it's, it's not mask. like a sheet mask. Okay. Yeah. I so see. cooling avocado clay mask. I don't think she's ever had a mask before, so it'll be something different. And then this I got at Target Mix Bar. It had good reviews. It's a coconut palm hair and body mist. And I think it just has like a nice light scent, um, which I thought she oh, would Oh, yeah. Like. It so, doesn't smell super coconutty, actually, but yeah, it, smells it smells nice. More yeah, just like fresh and clean almost. Yeah. 
So I thought that was like kind of a nice little thing for her to have. And then this is probably what I'm most excited for this looks to delicious. give her. It's a boba tea mix and it's matcha, which is her, she loves the green tea, mm -hmm. frappuccinos or any matcha things. Um, this so is three boba packets, three tea powders and three straws. So it's nice. It comes with the straw. It comes with everything. And they have um, different flavors of it too. Like they had a passion fruit run and different this from boba Amazon. Tea. Yeah. And they're instant boba too. So there's no boiling and straining and all of that. Yeah. So I thought she would think that was fun and just something a little bit unique that I think will still fit in her stocking. Yeah. So, so that is it. Is that it? <sighs> we've been doing this for hours. <laughs> Literally, I, like we've been keeping the kids and our husbands outside. Like, and I don't know if you can tell, but it's getting dark. Yeah, so it's getting dark. Our time <laughs> is coming to an end. Anyway, thank you guys so much for sticking around, for supporting us year after year. Um, if you love this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Make sure you go over and watch our What We Got For Kids Christmas video this year. It's just as long and epic as our past years and hopefully just as enjoyable. And I keep um, telling Hannah we need to do more videos together, so if you think we should, comment that down below too. <laughs> Alright you guys, we will see you again soon. Bye! Bye.